Welcome to Matt Riley Bakes. Today's recipe is these bad boys, pulled pork and caramelised red onion sausage rolls. What's not to like about that? To start off with, you need to get cracking with your pulled pork. I've got my pork shoulder here, which has been marinating overnight in paprika, smoked paprika, salt, pepper and cayenne pepper. You haven't got time to do that. Just bung it in with all the other ingredients. I've got some balsamic vinegar that's going in. Worcester sauce, dark brown sugar, and a little bit of water. That's going to take about four hours in my slow cooker until the meat falls apart. If you haven't got a slow cooker, you can do it in an oven in a heavy bottom pan with a nice tight fitting lid. Whilst your pork's doing, it gives you a chance to make a start on your red onion chutney. I've got some sliced onion here, which I'm popping in a bowl with some oil. I'm also adding the chilli to mine. That'll take about 15 to 20 minutes to soften up. There we go, that's what we're looking for. Nice and dark, lovely and soft. Now I'm going to add my balsamic vinegar, red wine vinegar, golden caster sugar. It'll take another 30 minutes or so till it's nice, thick and jammy. That's the onions reduced down. They look beautiful, they're lovely and sticky. They smell really sharp and delicious. Now it's time to move on to the meat. To take the meat out of all the juice. If you're having just pulled pork, you can tear the pork apart, reduce the liquid down and add the pork back to that. But for the sausage rolls, I don't want too much of the liquid. Get a couple of forks, tear the meat apart. It should fall apart really easily. Really. Because the meat's going to be cooked again and you don't want it to dry out too much, spoon over a couple of spoonfuls of the liquid just to keep it moist. If you want to make your own pastry, it's puff pastry I'm using for the sausage rolls, but shop bought works just as well. Lightly flour your work surface and roll the pastry out into a long rectangle, about 10 pence thick, and then cut it into two long strips. Now it's time to put your sausage rolls together. You want to put a line of your caramelised red onion down first, and then you're going to top that with meat. You want to run a line of egg down one edge of the pastry. It's going to glue your sausage rolls together, then roll it towards you. Now you've got one long sausage roll, cut them into equal lengths. You want to pop them onto a baking tray, give them a bit of egg wash, slash them on the top, and a little grind of black pepper, and then straight into the oven. They should take 15 to 20 minutes at 180 fan until they're lovely and golden brown. So there we go, my pulled pork and caramelised red onion sausage rolls. They're absolutely delicious. I hope you enjoy making them. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Matt Riley Bakes. <laughs>